Hey everybody, this is Joel and, and Jay from Maraviyanayarit.com. Gotta watch it don't fall in the pool, NJ. No. That actually could be clickbait. Clickbait. Maybe you should accidentally, accidentally fall, fall in the, the pool. pool. Wow, welcome to our video today. Um, it's you know, We said in the last video we did, remember when I got stopped by the police? Yeah. I'm like, wouldn't this be funny if we got actually stopped by the police because I made my, my secret move and like got a ticket? They'll be like, like good um, content. Yeah. And then lo and behold, we run into a police blockade. And they were literally to arrest me for, they thought I was like drinking and driving. And yes, I did have one really tiny margarita. Well, it looked bigger, but I told them to make it very weak because I had to drive. It was more like a lemonade with a splash of tequila, right? And I knew if I was to blow or something like that, I'd be, it probably wouldn't even show up. But anyways, they were pretty determined, I think, at one point to, you think they were just giving me a hard time? I think they're just giving you a hard time. Yeah. Because they, they're maybe looking for someone or just doing They were just job. getting bored because they weren't finding the guy they were looking for, so they wanted to get me. <clears throat> Anyways, I managed to talk my way out of it. And if you want to watch the full video, the unedited version, uh, just become a member. It's uh, 49 pesos a month. It's like less than three bucks. That's less than a coffee at Starbucks. It is. Once a month. And that goes to NJ's college fund. My college fund. <laughs> yeah, your college fund. If you ever decide to go to college, well, that money will be uh, set aside for NJ to do uh, with it as he pleases. What we're going to do today, uh, we're going to show you how to go to the butcher. Well, there's a few different butchers, and we'll do another video uh, another day where we go to local butcher. But we're going to go to Carne Select. And Carne Select is literally means select meat. I guess, you know? Meat select. Meat select. And it's, you know, I guess like the best, the, the selected meat. Uh, anyways, we usually go there to buy uh, our dog food because they have a pretty good uh, price on raw uh, ground beef, which I buy for 95 or 96 pesos a kilogram. So Boomer and Chicklet eat that. And then our office dog, Henry, who's still up for adoption. I can't believe it. Come on, guys, look at Henry. Look at him on the screen right there. Isn't he so sweet? He's a really good boy. And he, uh, he doesn't take a lot. He doesn't cost a lot. He eats chicken parts, which we'll go and see. I think they're like 14 or 15 pesos a kilogram. And he eats about a kilo a day. So it costs less than a dollar a day to feed old Henry here. And look at him. Look at Henry. Oh, he just wants a home. So if you're interested in adopting Henry, uh, reach out to us, comment below, send an email directly to me, uh, joel at nicholasgroup.com or info at maraviyanayarit.com and in the headline put, I want to adopt Henry. And uh, he's got his, all his shots, he's up to date, and he'll, he'll make a very, very good companion. What do you think, NJ? I think so, yeah. Anyways, let's, uh, let's get in the car, let's uh, drive over to Carney Select, and we're gonna show you actually how to do it, because there's a process on how you have to buy your goods at Carney Select. And a lot of, I was gonna say gringos, but foreigners go in there for the first time and they get completely confused. They don't know what to do. So we're gonna help you not make a mistake when you go for your first time to Carney Select. Listo? Listo. Vamonos. <laughs> In the last video, Mr. and Mrs. Fish, the best fish and chips in all of Mexico, no question. But if you want like just generally really, really delicious seafood, um, you gotta go to La, La Glorieta de Enrique. And that's right here on Cinco de Mayo, right uh, kitty corner to Cooley's and uh, Busi Burger, right over there, eh, Angie? Yeah, Busi Burger's Boosie right Burger, there. Like uh, blowing some smoke. But great burgers, great seafood, and a uh, higher end restaurant, you got Cooley's. Oh. And one last thing before we leave Cinco de Mayo. Yeah, we're, we're gonna I, do videos on these guys. And we're gonna do a Taco Tuesday so. video here. Okay, tacos and beer. Tacos and beer. All right, look at them. They're, uh, you know, they're actually, they're, they're pretty busy back there. They're, they're pretty busy back there. Hey, hey, que esta pasando? Buenas noches, feliz año. <laughs> <laughs> One time I came in and I forgot to do this. Then someone got really annoyed at me. So take your ticket. You know like the soup Nazi from Seinfeld? It's a little bit like it's that. a little bit like that. I see. Because if you don't do this right, they're like, no meat for you. No soup for you. So I'm C70. Uh, cinco kilos molida, especial, 
So what you want to do is you ask uh, what you want. So I know I want the molida especial. And here's like uh, simple ways you can practicar tu español. Por ejemplo, solo necesitas saber los números. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco. And kilos, okay? So por ejemplo, si estás aquí, if, for example, if you're here, and you want two kilos of beef, you say, dos kilos molida especial, por favor. And then you know what? You sound like a local. <laughs> hey? Did I sound pretty local there? Yeah, Not yeah. local, local. 92 uh, pesos, 0.90 a kilo, that's the price. Check that out, NJ. <clears throat> and we're gonna get five kilos for the puppies. That'll last them about eight days. You know, and sometimes we'll mix rice with it and some other stuff. We call it the chum bucket, and we can extend it out to nine or 10. So good old Henry, he loves the dentros de pollo. And the dentro de pollo is a little bit less than 15 pesos a kilo. That's 15 pesos por kilo. So used to feeding our dogs like dry food. But since we moved to Mexico, the, I met the vet and he's like, just feed them like raw food. Throw them a chicken. They'll love it. And, but some of the dogs do and some don't. Like so Boomer and Chicklet do not like chicken. Henry gobbles that up. We should take a video of him eating it. But that's all he eats. Like, uh, you know, about three quarters of a kilo of that, and he's, uh, he's good to go. They'll always ask you, algo mas? So something more? And you could say, no, sería todo. That will be all. Or, si, sí, hay algo mas? Yes, there's something more. Cuatro kilos dentro de pollo. And she wanted to know if I wanted specific dentros, but it doesn't matter. Henry loves all the dentros. Huh? He's a dentro lover. Huh? He's a dentro he's lover. He's a dentro lover. Look at the price, sir. Fourteen ninety a kilo. Cheap. You gotta adopt Henry. He's like, uh, he's a cheap date. So the next thing she's gonna do is she's gonna print out a little ticket for me. So she's there and she's like printing it out. And then I'm gonna get my ticket. Yes. Buenas noches. Then you go stand in the next line. Okay. And remember, you don't want them to say no meat for you. No soup for you. Okay, you gotta do this in a very specific way. One, one time I forgot to uh, take, because this thing's kind of new, I think. It never used to be there. You just stood in line and you just waited your turn. And then they just implemented this and I didn't even notice it. And I came in and I caused a ruckus. Because I was there and then I'm like, I'm next, I'm next. And then this other guy, and this guy, he had like, um, you know what, the, the tracheal thing? So he came up with this little computer thing and he just started yelling at me. He's like, you are number 70. <laughs> it's just going, I'm like, I couldn't understand it, but he was like yelling at me in Spanish. And then everyone was like going crazy. And I'm like, sorry, 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 like, lo siento. Like, this is thing is new. I've never seen this thing here before, but now I know. But they wanted me to know the system. I'm like, don't worry, ya sabemos. <laughs> As we're waiting to pay, uh, 526.22. Guess what I'm gonna pay with, Andre? The good old dollar app. Okay, so if you're looking for a great way to hold US dollars and pay in pesos when you're in Mexico and do it at the best exchange rate possible, the dollar app is the best card for that. And there's a link in the description. Sign up, because I think NJ gets, uh, you get $5 or something? $5. I think he gets $5 when you when you do your first purchase or first transfer on the dollar app. And that helps out with what? Your college cost. <laughs> So now they know she said number 12, which is our, our, our thing. This guy's gonna bring it. And she says, Quiere una bolsa? Do you want a bag? So otherwise, you're just gonna get the meat just like that. So she says, Quiere una bolsa? You could say, Si, sí, una bolsa, por favor. What I like to do also is uh, make sure you tip the, the staff, okay? Hey guys, you know, you get your bag and all that kind of stuff, but everything a little home. So when you're at the grocery store, someone wants to like take your bag for you, you know, like to throw them a little money because they're, you know, every bit counts, right? And that's it. That's how you shop. You got the meat. Yeah. Ready for any select. What? what is it? What time is it in, Boomer? Boomer? What time is it? What time is it? Is it dinner time? Din din time. Come on guys, I can actually get Is it din din time? Chicky boom boom din din time. Is it din din time? Is it din din time? Is it din din time? Chicky boom boom din din time! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, they're, 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 they're being a little lame.
I'll, I'll throw in the video when, when they absolutely lost their mind the other day. Basically, you know, about two and a half good sized hamburgers, right? There's boomers. That's what he gets. And then Chicky. Two and a half good sized hamburgers too. And there's chickies. And sometimes we'll throw in some stuff like carrots, some rice. Okay, everyone set. Set. Stay. Boomery. Chicky, set. Leave it. Leave it. Leave it. Okay. Huh? This is appetizing stuff. It looks appetizing, yeah. Mm. Okay, so we have some backs and we have these necks. And that's pretty well what Henry's gonna do. There's his plate of chicken. Mm. And what do you think? Can a dog eat that? Bone and all? I think so. Let's go see. Hey, it's the Eukster. And it's Henry. Hey, guys. Oh, it's din, -din time, Henry. It's din, -din time. Set, 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 Are you in camera shot, Henry, or you just don't know which one you want? That's his new ritual, he tests it out first. He tests it out first? You saw him do that? Yeah. And this is how a dog eats chicken. It's wild. Gone. <laughs> he just like devoured that. Oh, hold on. He's get got these big paws, hey? Look at them. Yeah, he's probably going to be the same size as Tato. I think he's going to be a big beast. Look at him, he's got this big fluffy tail. And he's still a little skinny, but he's starting to put on a little bit of fat now. That's weird. I don't think I've ever signed off at night with a big light shining in my face. But we showed people how to go to Carne Select, how to actually order your meat, um, how we feed our dogs here in Mexico. And, uh, and our kitty cat, well, he just eats the normal dry food. Although I think he really likes that chicken too, but Henry doesn't let him anywhere near it. Anything on that note, Henry, anything else to add? I think that's everything for okay. today. Well, thanks again for joining us. Um, please uh, join our membership program because that allows you access to all the, the stuff we don't publish to the public. Like, like when I almost got arrested in Mexico, there's that video on it. Um, and it's 49 pesos a month. That's like something like three bucks or something less than that a month. And it's less than a cup of coffee and it goes to NJ's college fund as we've, we've said. And uh, I think that about wraps it up. Until the next video, hey NJ? Until the next time. Nos vemos hasta luego and adios desde Bucerias on the Upper East Side in Bucerias, Mexico.